What's up, people? It's your boy Jatuan, and I'm here today with Bubble Guts 1. And this craft will hopefully make it into the air, even though I have a lot of doubts that it will do so. And for some reason, my gear are down. No, my gear are up. Uh, they, they are inside of the concrete. Huh. <laughs> well, that's certainly interesting. Well... You know what? We're going to try this anyway. We're going to try this anyway. And uh, as you can see here, we have an alternate propulsion method. Oh. <laughs> that didn't work at all. So this is going to be harder than it looks. <laughs> now, if you're wondering where this idea came from, I uh, saw this. Oh! Uh, what the hell is that? Whoa! Whoa! <laughs> Okay, this project is becoming hilarious. I saw on XKCD that there was a cartoon on TWR. So it's your thrust to weight ratio. Uh, pretty much it's just saying that, you know, if, if your thrust can overcome your weight, then you will have you will have propulsion. Propulsion. Now, I wanted to incorporate that into an airplane using a weapon as they did in their a cartoon. I will post the link to said cartoon in there where they were talking about the GAU-8 cannons uh, offering enough propulsion to actually uh, lift the vehicle. Uh, so I went and remembered that BD Army has the GAU-8 uh, cannon in there. That didn't work too well for me right there. We're going to revert to launch so you can get another shot of that. Alright, and here we go and everything just kind of um... <laughs> and then you have that monstrosity oh god what what are you <laughs> that is many ways of awesome right there oh my god okay so I'll be right back and I will see if I can get this thing to work somewhat right. So hang tight. Alright, I actually had to take the other series. I had uh uh what was it? I had it 16, I believe it was. Uh, uh guns on the back here. So I had to remove half. So let's see what happens. Uh let's go ahead and arm our cannons and go. We're doing it! We're doing it! <laughs> oh, 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 that's awesome! We don't need no engines! Now, if it didn't overheat, uh, we'd be doing a lot better right now, but unfortunately... We are definitely um, overheating, but we are able to overcome it nonetheless. So, yeah, that's working beautifully. And you can see our speeds are steadily increasing. We actually got up to 100 meters per second that time around. That's actually pretty good. We're getting some decent height out of this. But we need to... Um, 
need to try to loop around here. Oh. Oh. I think I got it. I think I got it. I think I got it. <laughs> there we go. Okay. Let's get our gear down. And uh, now we need to actually somehow land this beast. And nice and easy touchdown. Oh. <laughs> we are not breaking. It breaks. All right. There you go. And that's how you get back to the runway. Whoa, Nelly. Oh. <laughs> it works. <laughs> so there you go. Uh, I'm not saying it's proof of concept in real life because clearly if, you're, if your gun's overheated, you probably end up melting the barrels before you could do anything beneficial as far as getting into the air. And even if you did, you wouldn't be able to carry enough ammo in order to stay in the air and do any type of maneuvers like I just did. And plus, you would kill anything behind you. Destroying your own base, it would be pretty much carnage all the way around. So it's not a good idea. Don't do it. If you're going to try to do it... <laughs> um, this is your perfect evidence. Uh, <laughs> we don't need no stinking jet engines. <laughs> Unfortunately, anyone that was out on the deck that day No Kerbals would be remaining. <laughs> yes! Yes! Nailed it! Nailed it! Yes! It could work! <laughs> Well, make sure you're being safe about it, record it for posterity, and throw it on the internet because we'll, we like that sort of thing. That's the kind of people we are. But make sure you do it safely. Safety first. <laughs> All right. If you like what you're saying, hit that like button. Drop me in a comment. Let me know what you think. Let me know what ideas you have and uh, what other crazy things you've been able to accomplish in this game. This mod is from BD Armory. I will go ahead and drop a link to that in the in the description below, as well as the comment to the XKCD that was talking about the TWR and using weapons to overcome your weight and to create, to generate thrust and the different guns that they have that they studied. It's pretty cool. Anyhow, I'm going to get on out of here. I got some additional things to do, but I'll catch you guys in the next video. It's your boy Jatois, and I'm out. Peace. Yeah, that works. Oh, it kind of doesn't. But, we, it, yeah, it's, it's definitely not real life. No, no. Wow, rock and roll died quick. <laughs>